Overcoming Barriers to Bedside Shift Report, a Quality Improvement Project by Kelly Burke and Faculty Chair, Dr. Rod Arrieta. Handoff is the transfer and acceptance of care and responsibility of a patient from one provider to another. This is known as shift report. Nurses partake in shift report several times throughout a patient's hospitalization. This process allows for valuable information to be omitted and an opportunity for delay in treatment, adverse or sentinel events or readmissions. It is recommended for report to occur at the bedside to improve communication and increase, increase patient engagement. This would be known as bedside shift report or BSR. Nurses' misperceptions of BSR inhibit successful implementation and it is challenging for leadership to make sustained changes to the process. The PICO question guide in this project was, does providing an evidence-based educational session to registered nurses change attitudes and behaviors of BSR? The overarching aim of this project was to assess attitudes and behaviors towards BSR pre and post intervention. The objective of the project was to formally assess attitudes and behaviors towards BSR pre and post intervention and provide an educational intervention about BSR. The John Hopkins evidence-based practice model and the Lewin's change theory served as a framework for this quality improvement project. This was a mixed method to assess nurses' attitudes and behaviors of BSR using a pre-test, post-test design. An educational service was provided to participants, which included a PowerPoint and an educational simulation video of the BSR. The Bedside Handover Attitudes and Behaviors Questionnaires, or BHABQ, measured the attitudes and behaviors pre and post intervention. Four open-ended survey questions were provided post intervention to provide qualitative data. This occurred at a telemetry unit at a nonprofit community hospital. A total of 48 recruited participants. Demographics were obtained on 47. There were 39 peer tests for statistical analysis and 41 qualitative data results. A Wilcoxon signed rank test revealed statistical significance with a Z of negative 5.657, a P 0 0.000 with an R of 0 0.636, indicating statistical significant significance with a large effect size. A content analysis identified the themes quality, safety, and efficiency. The majority of the participants were in agreement with the key concepts and skills of BSR, which is consistent with the original research findings. Many nurses lack training and ship report, and it is a skill learned on the job. This is necessary for the, to implement education for the translation of knowledge to increase evidence-based practices. Post-education, participants have a higher level of agreement with BSR and agree with the concepts. They strongly agree with the concepts of patient engagement and involvement during report. Participants voiced multiple facets of improved quality with this reporting process and describe patients to have a higher level of engagement. When patients are included in BSR, they gain knowledge of their medical care and diagnosis. Limitations of this project included that it was conducted at one site on a single unit with a small sample size. Participants were at work during the educational service, which could decrease their engagement. There was immediate retesting of content and due to the academia program, there was time constraints that limited delivery of this project. Recommendations for the future would include to conduct audits of bedside shift report, to look at me to measure HCAP scores from a retrospective view and at regular intervals post intervention. Future studies should conduct focus groups for qualitative data. There needs to be continued support from leadership to provide guidance and to speak with nursing staff to assess any new barriers and identify strategies to overcome said barriers. Continue to provide education to onboarding staff and those that have difficulties time sustaining changes. Thank you 